I'm Deandra Rhodes and I'm an MFA candidate at HBU. My art is connected to my spiritual journey, and to my travels, um, and it, really when I look, look at it, it's about the resurrection of the feminine. So I've sort of looked, you know, since the time, uh, since the early medieval period, up through now, and it, it also chronicles my own spiritual uh, experiences and but I've looked at how women have been treated in civilizations and my whole optic I guess is to have them overcome or to show in my work a transformation and overcoming of, of the feminine being repressed so this work has been an exploration of things that have happened in the early medieval Catholic Church and uh, things that have happened culturally I look at women and their cultural uh, re restrictions and then how does that transformation come about and so some of my work shows I use the tango couple as a freedom dancing is is a freedom or I use maybe the ships uh, on the water as a freedom from the past what I'm working on now is I've done a whole series of print making because it's, I love to collage and it's been a great uh, resource for me to learn how to push my imagery to bring more mystery into it. Now I'll bring that back into my painting because I'm actually a painter and so I've started some paintings. I'm working, I'm changing my color palette from you know a brighter to a more earth tone uh, color palette and I, I will I have some large paintings uh, showing then again dealing with my spiritual transformation my experiences of my spiritual transformation i love the creative process and um, i just feel happy when i'm making art and i feel fulfilled and i don't know what i'm going to do so it's an adventure and at, you, at first the adventure scared me <laughs> and i would kind of freeze up i don't know what to do but now it's like oh what am I going to do? What will happen? And even mistakes. I like to see if I can use what I consider mistakes as, well, how can I use this? Because maybe it's not a mistake. There is a piece that I was working on called Bound in the Garden. And M uh, Michael had asked me to bring more mystery to my work. So I was experimenting with uh, printmaking and in this particular piece I actually went and I, I did my collage in layers and so I printed this piece up like four or five times. I did acetone transfers and I was so excited when I finished the piece because then I knew it was mysterious. It had the, it had the qualities, the storytelling qualities that I wanted, but it had the mysteriousness that Michael had been asking me to, to work for. And I sent it to him and I was like, oh, I finally made art. I feel that when I'm doing my work, I am in touch with a higher power, and I feel that I'm actually trying to channel that experience. I mean, it's my goal to live as a spiritual being in a physical body and to really, um, you know, to show my experience in my work. 